It's time now to hear from your fans. We call it sliding to our DMs because they have been sliding a lot today. We've got a lot of questions for you. So, what do they want to know? Oh, there's a lot of questions. <laughs> they're actually, before I get to a specific question, a lot of questions about your work previously with Britney Spears. Mm -hmm. and, and oh my gosh, really? Is that in the past now in terms of your new direction that you're going with your music or do you still like to highlight moments like that? I love Britney Spears, so I'll never get over that moment. I can talk about it every time I do an interview <laughs> because it was just like one, it's a career highlight for me. Collaborating with your childhood idol, like it doesn't really get much better than that. So. Has, it, has it like slowed down in time, that, that moment when you were, were working together? Yeah, it doesn't feel 100% real, I'm not going to lie. It really doesn't. Did you keep your cool or were you a big fangirl? I definitely kept my cool. I was just like, but on the inside, I was like. <laughs> I reckon you're lying. You would have been, I can see how excited you get. Okay. I love her. All right, let's get into it. Uh, what's, this is, comes from Casey G. What okay. stands out the most in your mind? Oh, that's what I just asked about Britney Spears. So I'm going to go on to. Okay. <laughs> what, sorry, Casey G. What has been your okay. favorite Cory, as in choreography? Oh, um, hmm, that I've ever done. I'm going to say my favorite choreography is All Hands on Deck, which is a video I put out in 2016. But I will say that I think that is the most, like, signature dance moment that I've had. Um, in terms of like, if I go to a show, the people in the crowd know all the dance moves or um, it's just something that I can always kind of go back to. Like that was a really great moment choreography wise. So okay. that. this one comes from, I think it's Mila Blacco. Okay. So, okay, she wants to know, I'm, not, I'm just filtering through these questions. There's yeah. so many right now. Okay. <laughs> it's okay. Uh, Take your time. This one's Drink okay, my yeah. wine. Dance video. Oh, I put it out Marnie. in 2015. They corrected me. It was in 2015, not 2016. See, the fans always know. Sorry. Okay, this question. <laughs> it just says, I'm going to quote her, dance video Normani, question mark. Ooh, that would be a problem. <laughs> I don't think the GP is ready for that. <laughs> I don't think they are. <laughs> I don't think the internet is ready to be broken. <laughs> <But>. <laughs> I think the fans would like that. I know I'll get past all the collaboration ones because people obviously fans love those. But one yes. was, and the answer to all the collaborations is I would love to collaborate with all of them and hope to in the future. So. Ticked, including because like twenty years said Ariana. Of course, of course, of course, guys. Okay. Um, you have some really, really passionate fans here. They're so nice. My fans are the best. And also, like, beyond nice, they're, like, also crazy. Like, they're rabid. They're like, what's next? Where's the content? Where's the videos? <laughs> Where's more stuff? All right. Uh, Tim Armick would like to know the artwork that you've been doing and selling. How much of that? Yes. How's it gone? Because I, I read when the post, when you posted, it was, like, 13,000 people have fed so far. How's yeah. it been going so far? We've raised enough money to feed a small town. So that is really, 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 really incredible. It's awesome to be able to, I mean, I've never sold any of my art before. So to be able to, like my paintings, obviously music, but my art, art. Your physical so, art. Uh, yeah. It's nice to be able to do that um, for a good cause. All of the money was, you know, given towards families who need, food right now during the pandemic so that felt awesome um yeah that was just really cool it's a really really special thing that you can do yeah it's it's great to see the reaction cool. from all your fans okay we've got two chain james says hey. what has been your most what has been your most know. enjoyable song to write on your last lp or album and why oh the most enjoyable to write i kind of always go with stormy weather because that was the most fun session uh, on my last album that sticks out of my mind. Um, I just remember like all my friends were in the room at the time. So it was kind of like one of those studio sessions that borderlines on a party. And those are fun because 
you get the energy of the people in the room and you kind of feed off of that, of your friends and stuff. And um, my drummer, my MD was like adding sound effects by like playing his drumsticks on like the table and we were recording it and adding it to the track. And it was just like a great collaborative. We made the beat that night. We did the whole thing that night. So that, and I think we stayed up to like 7 a.m. It was like an all nighter kind of session. So I think that was, that's my answer. That was the most fun. Start Fans. Off. Great <laughs> questions. Thank you so much.